Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be doing my February BoxyCharm unboxing. And it is kind of late. I've had this for like two weeks already. Not two weeks. Like a week and a half, possibly. But yeah, I've had this for a week and a half and I'm just now barely opening it for you guys. But yeah, I'm going to be testing out these products on my face and unboxing at the same time. So if you guys would like to see what I got in my box, then just keep on watching. Okay guys, so I'm going to be doing my makeup as we go along with the items in this box. So whatever I pull out is the stuff that I'll be doing throughout my makeup routine. So let's get into the box. Okay guys, the first item in my box is the No Pore Blend Primer by Touch and Soul. It says it's a smooth and pore covering top secret for perfect makeup. And it's a glass bottle, so it's super cute. I love the packaging. That is what it looks like. It's like pink. I'll test this out right now, but let me see the price. This is worth $18. And I've never used any items from Touch and Soul. That is what it looks like. I am going to be adding this to my face to prime the face. Okay, so the consistency of this kind of reminds me of the Smashbox um, Photo Finish Primer. But it does feel kind of like, like it has moisture in it in a way. I don't know how to explain it. And it kind of smells like a face cream. Okay, so I did most of my face off camera and I did my foundation after concealer and I just went in with my Fenty Beauty foundation but I did my um, blush and my contour as well using the Kat Von D palette shade and light palette and then I just did my eyeshadow using my Pixie by Petra shadow palette anyways let's move on the next item in my box is by Pretty Vulgar and it is the Shimmering Swan Sparkling Sass Highlighter and that is what it looks like, and I love Pretty Vulgar. The packaging is just to die for. That is what it looks like. I will swatch it. Look at that shine, guys. And we have gotten, actually, what I used today as my blush is the Pretty Vulgar Make Them Blush Hush Blush, and that is what it looks like. We got this in a previous boxy charm, and I am currently wearing that on my face today. This is what that looks like. Anyways, I'm so glad that I now have the blush and the highlighter so I'm going to be trying on the highlighter so let's get to it so I'm just going to take my Morphe highlighting brush and just add some of this highlight it does pretty much illuminate your face it gives it a nice glow not like picking it up but okay so it did give me like a subtle look for like an everyday highlight and that highlight is worth $32 so I like it for a subtle it you can use this for an everyday highlight so I'm cool with it okay guys the next item in my box is uh, better than sex Too Faced Mascara, that is what the packaging looks like, and it's pretty heavy, and I have tried this mascara um, one time when my cousin did my makeup, and I did like it. And my favorite is, um, which one is it? Roller Lash by Benefit, so um, a lot of people rave about this mascara, though. They say it's really good, and a lot of people love it, so I'm actually excited to get a new mascara, and especially it's a good brand, Too Faced, a well-known brand. So yeah, this mascara retails for $24. So I am gonna just curl my lashes with my eyelash curler and pop some of this mascara on. Okay guys, so it did lengthen my lashes and I always wear falsies so I do have a problem with my lashes like when I yank the falsies off some lashes do come off because the glue sometimes really suck so um, I think it looks good though on my lashes so not a bad mascara but I will keep trying it out um, to 
see if I actually like it. I did, I remember I did pick this up on a 21 Days of Ulta sale, but I have not like even opened it yet. It's still like in the Ulta bag. I need to wait for it. But yeah, I'm glad that um, I did get this in my box because it is a pricey mascara. So yeah. Okay, the next item in my box is by Tristique and it is the, let me pull it here. Um, Tristique Prime and Glaze Lip Crown. This two-in-one lip dual features a luxurious lip combo soothing primer on one side and shiny color glaze on the other side. And this retails for $25. This is what the packaging looks like. And that is what the lipstick slash liner, I guess it's a liner on one side. It has the magnetic. And then this is the balm it comes with. So I am going to put this on my lips. So let's get started. <laughs> Okay guys, so this is what the lippy looks like and it's such a pretty color. I don't really usually wear these berry colors that much because I've been so into like nudes. But um, yeah, I think it's a... And it's an English rose, by the way, the color that I got. But I think it's really pretty. Like, it's it's really hydrating and it's not, like, sticky or drying or... Yeah. But I think it really adds the pop to the look. And, okay guys, the last item in my box is by Pharmacy, the Clean V Ultra Gentle Facial Cleanser. And I'm super excited. Um, last time, I know they gave something from Pharmacy in a box, and it was the balm, the cleansing balm. And I was so bummed that I did not get that in my box. So I'm really excited to um, actually get skin product from Pharmacy because it is a pricey brand. It's Sephora. Um, I do have like their, it's like a lip balm type of thing and a little round tube thing. Not tube. It's a little round little tub. But I am excited to use this. I'm not going to test this out, obviously, in this um, video. But this retails for $22. And it's supposed to soothe and hydrate your skin while lifting dirt, excess oil, impurities, grime, and makeup. So I'm super excited for this. Alright, guys. So that was my unboxing um, for this month. Um, I thought it was a pretty great box. I really am digging the lippy. And that's like one thing that I least expected to like out of the box, to be honest. But I think it's such a nice color and it's hydrating and it's perfect for this weather that's like been rainy and really cold. My lips have been cracking, obviously. But yeah, um, so just a run around. We did get the Pharmacy Clean Bee Cleanser. I got the Tristique Lippy in English Rose. I got the No Pore Blem Primer by Touch and Soul. I got the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. And last but not least, I got the Pretty Vulgar and Shimmering Swan Sparkling Sass Highlighter. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys!